Well, it's Friday morning. I think it's around 10 o'clock a.m. And Friday, July 11th, 2014. And a, a new, two new ones came out in Walpole on the Connecticut River. One of them, one of them did the boat launch. But it's a two and a half five. So I had to get it, and that'll fill my two and a half, two and a half difficulty all the way across. So I can go for the. We're also going for the first to find, but I didn't mess. I didn't hurry for that. It came out last night too, so I'm sure someone's up there in a the canoe right now going to them. One's on the landing, one's at the thing. Taylor's gonna have to stay here for this one. Then I'm going to go down and get the wet retreat by myself, and then I'm going to come home, and then I'm going to take her, and we're going to go to Spofford and get the two out there. I'm going to take her in the canoe kayak with me to Spofford. Well, it's 11.30 a.m. We're at the boat launch in Walpole. Coming down looking for... First to find on Zora's River 4B Zelda Cache, which is at the boat launch. Let's see, we have the kayak, and then we're going out to the island and look for another first to find, Windfall Island. Okay, we're heading down to the Windfall Windfall Island one. There was somebody at the kiosk, and he's parked right in front of the kiosk. It almost looked like Captain Bob, but. He didn't have his canoe with him, and I would think if it was him, he'd have his canoe also, but... Anyway, so I didn't get that one for now, so someone will probably get that in between me going down here and coming back. My lot. But we'll try to get this first to find on the island down there. Well, we're here at the island. It's point one further still. And that's a swooping downstream thing, and I ain't gonna paddle back through that canal. And it's pretty good down here too. I don't feel like paddling back up that either. So I think I'm going to walk from here and see if I can get it. There's the bridge right there. Going over from Westminster to Walpole. Okay, I hope they don't let any sudden water out of the dam. And she floats off on me. I hope no one comes and steals her. But here we go. I'm going to walk down this way toward the island. It's not going to be a fun walk, but I guess some boots I'm going to put on, I think. Matter of fact, I know. Found them at a free pile on my paper route. See, it would have been fun coming down this, but I didn't want to paddle back up at it. I guess if I stayed on the edge it wouldn't have been bad. Not much current on the edge. And once I get down through here I guess it flattens back off. Maybe I should go get back in the canoe and come down through it. In the kayak. I may have to anyway. I might not even be able to walk to it. It's still showing 430 feet. truck through woods if I can go drive up through it from shore. Yeah, I should have came down through this. I could paddle back up through it no problem. Oh wow. Ain't gonna do it now. Wow. Never say never. Wow, look at all these clamshells. Wow. I didn't know there was that many freshwater clams in the Connecticut River. Wow. Okay. Huh. Yeah, we're still 200 feet away. I ain't walk. Yeah, looks like I gotta go get the kayak. It'll be fun coming down it, but I don't want to paddle back up it, but there's no way I can walk over there. Okay. Gotta take the kayak down. Go back and get her.
shit, I forgot to film it. We had to go on shore right over there. It's right there and over there. And them trees right there. Uh, first to find, we got it. 12.09 p.m. And now we're headed back up the channel. We just came down. I was up there a little ways and I forgot to film, so I pulled my camera out and I drifted back down to here. But we're headed back out. Well, we're back up to the end of the island. I just tried to paddle across that and I couldn't make it. I ended up sideways, hit a rock there, that first ruffle, there's a big rock there making that ruffle. I hit that sideways into them trees and I cut across over here before I got to those trees over there. But I'm just going to pull it over there and then go out that way. I'm not going to try to battle it again. I couldn't get across it, it took me down that way. It was fun. There's a bridge down there and you can see the island underneath the bridge on the other side. We made it back. This is our docking area. You gotta come in this little inlet and pull it up that hill up to where it is now. Look how steep that is. It's not an easy hill to pull up. And they're letting out the water like a son of a gun so it was pretty tough paddling back up against the current and coming across. But we did it. Saw some nice I was just going to go over and look for that thing because no one's here. Look, that guy in the red truck just pulled back in. Packed right in the same place he was before. Son of a gun. I can't believe it. I should have ran right over there as soon as I come out of the water instead of filming. But I wanted to film the, film the, the docking, or the undocking. I got to drag it over the car right over there on the other side of that truck. 